Listen to the words that Jesus says to you. Come to me, all of you who are weary, and I will give you rest. Take my yoke upon you and learn from me, because I am meek and humble of heart. For you will find rest for your souls, because my yoke is easy and my burden is light. You must recognize that true refuge, your true haven, your true oasis is going to be found in the most sacred heart of Jesus. So I would suggest three things for you. Find some time every day to enter into a deep dialogue, a deep conversation with the Lord. Talk to the Lord. Tell him what's going on in your life. As Peter says, cast your cares upon the Lord because he cares for you. Find time to open up and talk to the Lord because he loves you. He is your best friend. Second is, go and visit him. You see, the Sacred Heart is beating with love. Where can you find the Sacred Heart of Jesus? In the church. In the Blessed Sacrament. In the Monstrance. That is really Jesus. You see this picture right here? It's a symbol. But there in the church, in the tabernacle, the loving heart of Jesus is beating with great love for you. It's a fire that's emanating from his heart, and that fire wants to consume you with his love. And lastly, if possible, go to Mass. Go to the Holy Sacrifice of the Mass. Participate in the Holy sac Sacrifice of the Mass. Love the Mass. And if you're in the state of grace, we hope you are. Then approach the altar. And receive Holy Communion. And when the priest says the body of Christ, you say, Amen. Then you receive the host, which is the body, the blood, the soul, the divinity of Jesus Christ. But it also is his sacred heart. You have what we might even call a spiritual heart transplant. The heart of Jesus Christ has entered into your heart. So come to me. All of you are weary, and I will give you rest. Take my yoke upon you, and learn from me, because I am meek and humble of heart. You will find rest for your souls. My yoke is easy, and my burden is light.